And here he talks a little bit about the morality of war. It was not a simple matter of kill or be killed. I had to think of my men. I could not let them be killed because of a rigid morality on my part. But if I compromised with that morality too often, I would become little more than a war criminal, unfit to lead those men's. I had to struggle to keep a sense of balance. That's the, that's the crazy thing about the dichotomy of leadership is that these, these opposing forces that are pulling you in two different directions, they're both, they're both correct. Yep. It's correct. They're both correct. And the balance is where you need to stay. I shouldn't say that they're both correct, but they're both viable options. Yeah. You can rationalize either one of them. You can rationalize, hey, we shouldn't do anything at all. Let's just stay inside the wire. Let me protect my guys. And you can rationalize that. And you can rationalize, hey, let's go out and kill everybody before they kill us. Mm. And what you have to do as a leader in a combat situation, you have to balance those dichotomies. And, you know, you could translate that into businesses. Because you, in a business, you've got to take care of your people, but you've got to make money. Yeah. So there's all these, when you're in a leadership position, there's opposing forces that are pulling at you, and you have to balance them. And you have to pay attention because what happens is suddenly you start going too far in one direction or the other and you start to re you start to lose control or you start to see things go sideways. That's when you need to say to yourself, wait a second, am I going too far in one direction right now? That's probably what is happening. 